Wildstone, 12 and three quarter pounds, wearing the black trunks in his 15th professional fight from Northampton, David Cahol. His opponent in the red corner, weighed in at nine stone, 11 pounds, in his 23rd professional fight, having won all 23, 15 by way of knockout, wearing the black shorts with the white trim from Kentish Town, London, Stephen Smith. Your referee for the contest, Mr. Marcus McDonald of Woodford in Essex. Thank you. Boys, you've got no the box, you don't explain it to you. I want to be real safe, aim at us at all times, especially on a safe break. I mean, young Sammy Smith, young Sammy Keogh. Have a good one, boys, let's get it on. Big date coming up soon for Stephen Smith against Bobby Vanzi when he challenges for the British and Commonwealth lightweight titles. That's on November the 29th. He wanted to fight Vanzi tonight. Instead, he warms up for it against David Cahoe of Northampton, a 26 year old who has lost more than he's won so far and is caught by a left hand straight away from Steve Smith who is something of a pin-up in North London. A lot of his fans are female. And plenty of them at ringside usually too. This might be a little bit too deep for Keho, but let's see. In racing terms, he's got something to prove on the book here. A novice being pitched in with a guy who's being groomed for a classic. Smith's the one with the white tassels on the trunks, if you're not sure of the identification and the boxes are unfamiliar to you, as they might well be. Warning for Keho early on for his untidy work. Smith unbeaten in 23 fights so far, 15 wins by knockouts. Looked a very good technician, not a big puncher, but quite knowing. And Smith's a good fighter. These are difficult ones. Just before he's going to move up in class, this is you know, the fight before the big one. And you know he obviously wants to look good. Just making a, a little few mistakes, getting tagged a, a bit as he comes in, Smith wrestled to the floor, no knockdown, and uh, Keho trying to unsettle the normally quite smooth rhythm of Smith, and sometimes uh, not quite in tune with the Queensbury rules as he does so, and incurring the displeasure of referee Marcus McDonnell. A lot of holding going on, and that's the second time I've warned you, says the referee to him. He's definitely... Uh, trying a few things yes Keho. he is there's a blatant low blow in there he did he did it on the blind side of the referee as well so i think he is under all as or has come out here with the intention of unsettling stephen smith and it's whether he can do that smith obviously a big favorite here and this is a fascinating division in Britain, headed by Billy Schwer, whose world title opportunity against Stevie Johnson comes up in December. On home territory, we think and hope, anyway. Looks that way at the moment. Shot round the back of the head this time from Keho. Also Colin Dunn, who holds a version of a world title at this weight. For Britain, Bobby Vanzi, who fights Smith soon. Oh, and the head going in as well there. Now he could be in very serious trouble here. There's a point deducted here for Keho, and he can't complain about that because the referee has almost had to give him the Gettysburg address in this first round. Well, he's obviously aware of the rules, Keho, but has just decided to disregard all of them. The bell goes just as Marcus McDonnell was about to have yet another word with David Cahill. You better clean it up, he tells the corner. 
otherwise I'm going to throw you out of there. That has to be a possibility, doesn't it, that Keho is going to get disqualified here. Uh, Well, I think that's a, a, de a definite. He's already took a point, I would think. Really, there's any more blatant infringements, he's going to be thrown out. Look at this low blow, he turns them around and then, I mean, yeah, that was on purpose. You know, he meant that. Get see it from another angle here. He's into the, the body, and then he just waits till the referee's out of the way, and then that one goes well south. And this is, look at this, on the back of the head, as is holding with the arm, and that's the, the point deduction. And there it is. David Cahill, a matchroom fighter, the Barry Hearn camp. He's on a run of four straight defeats in Mayfield. He needs to do anything he can to try to unsettle the normally smooth, but not tonight, Stephen Smith. Smith looking a little bit anxious somehow. And a bit open, too. Looks wild, doesn't he, for him? Yes, he seems as if he has something to prove. I don't know if there's a little bit of bad feeling between these two. If there isn't, I think there may well be now. He's in no kind of trouble. Smith is caught by a jab there. His defence not looking as good as it usually does. Now, I think he's trying a bit too hard. I think he has been unsettled, and now, you know, he wants to make a little bit of a point of it. This fight has been cut down in distance, and I think he's trying to speed everything up, you know, a little bit to his de detriment. Yeah, we're scheduled for six rounds, it's only four rounds they're fighting now. Smith keen to impress the TV audience and advertise his claims for that British lightweight title fight, but if we're honest with you, doing anything but so far. Well, he's struggling against this really rough and aggressive style of Keho. But Keho's a fighter who hasn't won for a year. Well, he needs to relax a little bit, Stephen Smith, looking to pick his punches more. Being dragged into something of a street fight here. Well, give some credit to Keho. He might have been fighting dirty in the first round, but he's doing the best he knows how against an opponent of, well, on paper, superior quality. That's better, using the jab this time. Smith. Smith is the son of the trainer, Darky Smith. One of the characters of the business. Spent most of his early career in Germany. Now, there's head work here, and he's out of it. He's out of it, Keho. He's disqualified. It is over. Stephen Smith wins in the most unsatisfactory fashion, and David Keho is disqualified. He was ramming the head in in the corner, and he's paid the penalty. Well, he, I mean, he really set out with what looks like trying to get himself thrown out. It really was a, a bad display. Second round, he started to land with some decent body punches. But, I mean, he really just threw it away with that sort of work. Well, some people are chanting for him behind us at ringside. That goodness knows why. It's the first time I've ever heard that for a fighter who's just been disqualified. Well, that, that is ridiculous. He looks as if he's feeling a bit of grief, but I don't think he can complain, really. Ladies and gentlemen, the result by means of disqualification to Keho, your winner, Smith. But it's not a night that he'll later. remember with much fondness, Stephen Smith, because although he won by disqualification, he didn't look good there, did he, in his last fight before fighting for the British title? No, he, he didn't, but I think you, know, you can really overrule that. I, I don't think it was a a good performance from him, he'd just be glad to get that one out of the way. Keho just come out here to unsettle him. It was the Vansy supporters who were cheering for Keho. Bobby Vansy is also on this bill tonight.